everyone, this is Jeannie, and welcome back to my channel. Let me scooch over. I'm doing a My Favorites for October and for um, November. And th these are just a few things that I have, and I thought I would come out here into the library and share these things with you. So one of my most favorite things that I got in, I think it was the very beginning of October, was the Too Faced chocolate bar, and I love it. I really, really, really love these. I love the heart-shaped colors. Um, I use all of them. I use everything. It's pink. It's pretty. They're delicious colors. They're there's not a lot of fallout. I know this isn't a very old palette, but um, it's the first time I've had it, and I, I love it. The next thing I wanted to share with you is castor oil. I started using castor oil on my cuticles. Three, I try to do it three times a day because your nails need a lot of oil, a lot of nourishment, and uh, I've noticed, I have to do my nails, they're a mess right now, but this castor oil is so lubricating for your cuticles, and I just rub it in every night, every morning, and then during the day if I remember. Sometimes I'm so busy, I don't remember, but I've noticed uh, a spurt and growth in my nails, so... I'm going to keep using this, and I use it a little bit on my eyelashes. It does help your eyelashes to grow, but I've, I've had a problem with my eyelashes growing, and I'll go into that in another video. So, My other favorite thing is, guess what? I found my favorite foundation, and this is Revlon. I love this foundation. It's Revlon Color Stay Whipped, and it's about nine or ten dollars. Um, Revlon is cruelty free. This is a glass container, which I really like. That to me, that's real important to have a glass. I just like glass, and I have two of these. <laughs> I got two colors. I got a light, light color, and then one that's a little bit darker. And I alternate back and forth. Sometimes I mix it up. But this stays all day long, and I love the coverage. The coverage is, it's like getting ready for a photo shoot, and it doesn't cake up. It's creamy. Um, it doesn't dry out my face, but then again, it's not oily on my face. So this Revlon... if you can see it color stay whipped is my favorite and it didn't cost an arm and a leg uh, let's see underneath my makeup I have been using for probably three months now this is consult beauty consult beauty <laughs> and it's a primer uh, for your skin called skin perfecting serum and since I've been using this I haven't really been using it a lot but lately I've been trying to use it underneath my new foundation and it hides any pores it's like talc, a light talcum powder all over your face and then it makes the foundation so easy to go on and apply and Maybe that's why I like the Revlon uh, Moisture Rip so much. I don't know. I think the combination of the two is great. And this costs $23.43, about $23. And I really like it. like it a lot. Uh, let me go into uh, two more items. This is my Organic Ara Keisha Rose Hip Oil. Now, my skin drinks this in, and I use it in the morning and at night, and um, 
I think I can tell a difference. I think I can tell a difference, but I'm going to keep using this. I've only been using it for about a month and a half, and I know your skin cells rejuvenate and regenerate, that's the word. And uh, I'm going to just wait and see how it improves my appearance. I'll let you know. My last favorite is my green pan, my, um, it's an orange pan. Things aren't supposed to stick to it, and I've had this for two months now, October and November, and we use it all the time. We scramble eggs in it, we, I fry, I don't fry a lot, but if I do have to fry something, I'll use this pan, and it was about I think it was $20 at Bed Bath & Beyond, but then I used their 20% off coupon, and so it brought the price down a little bit. <clears throat> I know Kay Carter has the, um, the square pan, I was thinking about getting that, but I have so much cookware, I don't need any more pans, but every now and then my saucepan, my little pan like this, wears out. So far, I don't have a nick in it, I don't have a scratch, uh, things do stick if you I mean if you put it on the burner and let it burn up it'll burn but you know if you if you cook normally the right way I have a feeling this is gonna last a long time so I love this pan it's a great gift great Christmas gift for practical people one of my favorite gifts that I ever got in my life <laughs> was a dust mop for my birthday. That's what I wanted for my birthday, a good fluffy dust mop because I have tile and I just wanted the dust mop. So that was one of my favorite gifts. So anyhow, I hope you loved and enjoyed my uh, video on my favorite October and November things. I hope everyone had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I am going to buy a clip-on mic, so I won't get any more complaints <laughs> about hearing me. Uh, so I'm so sorry. My last video was uh, very quiet, according to a lot of my dear friends, and I apologize for that. So have a wonderful Saturday, and I'll be back with Wednesday's Words, and I will talk to you later. Bye, everyone.